Hi guys and welcome to 123 MyIT. In this video we will show you how to set up the Samsung Galaxy Smart Tag 2. The Galaxy Smart Tag 2 is a device from Samsung designed to help you keep track of your items like keys, bags, old people and other personal belongings. It's part of Samsung's ecosystem of smart gadgets. In the box you get the Smart Tag, Quick Start Guide and a battery eject tool. To use the battery eject tool, there is a hole in the keyring part of the tag which you use to push the battery out. When setting up the tag for the first time, the battery will have a piece of plastic that you need to remove to give the tag power. If the battery makes contact and you've set the tag up properly, you should hear a beep. Excellent, the tag is active. If you don't hear the beep, try removing and re-adding the battery again. To set up the Smart Tag 2, you will need a Galaxy smartphone running Android 9 or above. I've tried setting this up with a Pixel and an iPhone and it doesn't work. You can still use it with a Pixel and iPhone, it just means you need to set it up with a Galaxy phone first. On your Galaxy phone, go to the Play Store and download the SmartThings app. Most phones will already have it installed, so go to the Samsung apps and open it up from there. The next thing you will need to do is sign in with your Samsung account. If you don't have a Samsung account, you can sign up for one, or you can use your Google account to sign in. Once you are signed in, tap Devices, and then tap the plus sign to add a device. Tap Scan Nearby, and you should see your Galaxy Smart Tag 2 pop up in the Available Devices menu. If you don't see it, you can try re-adding the battery again and restarting the process. Agree to the Use Location Terms, and then you will need to press your tag to confirm that the tag is the correct one you are setting up. Great success! You have now set up your tag. Go ahead and name it if you want to. Next you will have a smart tag options such as ringtone and volume and power saving mode which I think is really important if you want to have the tag work for a very long time. You can also see at the bottom an icon which shows you how much battery you have left on the tag which is really helpful if the battery gets low you'll know you'll need to get that tag back and change the battery on it. I want this tag to last for a long time so I'm going to put it in power saving mode. Awesome, it's all set up now. Remember at the beginning of the video I said you can still check it on an iPhone? Well here it is, go to smartthingsfine.samsung.com I will put the link in the description below and log in with your Samsung account and BAM there it is, shows you the location of the tag. Very easy to set up if you follow this video. One thing to remember is that this is not a GPS tracker. It works off Bluetooth devices in the area. Also, it will only give you updates around 15 to 30 minutes and sometimes longer. If you're looking to buy one of these tags, I will leave an Amazon link in the description so you can support the channel. Guys, don't forget to check out my other videos such as 9 differences between the S24 Ultra and the S24 Plus. And do me a favour, if you know anyone who might like this video, please share it with them, hit the subscribe button and smash the bell icon.